Hey, how's it going out there, dear everybody? I know we're shooting from a weird angle. I hope you're having a great day. I'm gonna set up my AC. We're gonna test everything here. We're gonna do this uh, legit. I'll show you how everything works. And uh, I'll do a kind of roundabout time test here. I will have to change some camera angles. So that will take some time, but just to give you an idea here uh, how fast I can get this set up. We'll get that rolling. First thing I have to do, turn on the key. Passenger side window down. I have to vent this uh, AC out the passenger side window. Uh, I grabbed this. I made this out of one of those window screens. I just glued some plexiglass to it on the back. Pretty simple setup. Uh, this goes in the window. Like so. Uh, get my fingers out of the way. Uh, roll the window up. Roll the window up here on it. Okay. That locks that in. And then what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to go out back. I'll take you out back with me here. And boy, this uh, GoPro suction cup is a is a winner. We'll go out back and we're going to start the generator up. So come with me come with me we'll go around we'll start up the generator and uh, I'll show you how simple all this really is to get done and uh, you'll see you'll see normally what I do is I go ahead and stop here at the passenger door and if you look right here I have my cord wrapped around here and a determined length that I already know goes to the back so I grab this on my way back around. Uh, I just run this out the door. I shut the door on it. I don't care, it don't hurt nothing. I run it right along the fairing, back around here to the generator. Let me set you up here. Uh, where we at? Okay, the GoPro fell off, had to start you over, but Let's see how easy it is to start this generator. First things we do, uh, release the vent on the fuel cap. Turn that to the on position. Everything you need to start it has yellow on it. Choke. Now I haven't started this in about two days, so we'll see how easy it is. There you go. And that's how loud it is. I mean, we're in between truck and trailer here, and that's literally as loud as it gets. Um, so while I'm back here, I take my, my plug. I plug my plug in, and uh, this thing runs for about, I don't know, 15, 16 hours on, a, on one and a quarter tank of fuel. Uh, this gas jug right here is two fill-ups. This is a two and a half gallon can and it'll fill this up twice. So about ever about every three days of running this, I have to go get a jug of gas because you know I don't run it all the time nonstop. Alright, I made it back into the truck. Let's get the AC rolling. First things first, you gotta expand this tube out. This tuba. Expand your tuba.
There we go. We're hooked up. We're rocking. Okay, so I got the AC running. She's on cool. She's on low. Let's kick her up to high. 61 degrees. I mean, that thing really starts to put out some freaking air at, at that temperature. It's not very hot in here right now. It's only 73 degrees. So later on in the summer when it gets really hot, I will get you some uh, test of, you know, how well it does in the extreme heat. To be honest with you, I bought the damn thing and it hasn't been, it just hasn't been uh, hot enough uh, since I bought it, you know? And um, what I do, what I do is I bring these curtains over and uh, let me turn on a light and figure out a place to how to do this. But basically what I do is I bring this curtain over and then I close it like this. And I move the AC back a little bit, so it's like, you know, all the all the hot air is getting ducked out the back. And uh, yeah, I kind of set it up like this. I do a little better job closing it up. Of course, I put my window shades in, and uh, yeah, I mean, you're talking about you're talking about cooling the situation down. Uh, now this will do it. Now, if I had this to do over again, I bought this 5,000 uh, BTU air conditioner because of um, I was going to run this off of batteries, but I come to find out the generator was so cheap and easy, uh, I just went with that. So get one that fits in front of the uh, passenger side seat. Now, this thing does have a remote. Um, you know, you can you can do some stuff with the remote if you want. Uh, You're supposed to be able to fulfill to move those louvers um, you can adjust your temperature and whatnot but um, it's a nice little AC it's a nice little AC there you go it took me about seven minutes to set it up I forgot to check this when I first got back in the truck but yeah it's about a seven minute process um, you know is it as easy and nice as just hopping in the truck and you know smashing a button and turning on your tri pack no it's not but um you know for a little bit of hassle yeah, i'm about a thousand dollars into this and it's saving me you know twelve thousand dollars i'm gonna get in the tri pack and uh, you know i run the upper midwest so i really don't need an ac you know for every minute of the day you know it's not like i'm running like you know nevada and arizona you know i'm i'm in the upper midwest so come september i really don't even need ac you know i only need it for about three or four months a year so uh this is the way i did it now that man is a genuine steel belted gear jamming rig jockey that's a fact boy howdy oh, you said that again yeah you know boy